and it's the great death bowler Malinga against the great finisher Doni. And at the moment, the death bowler is winning from both ends. This is the contest we've been waiting for. Let's see how good this is. Full and wide. Wide Yorkers. Pulisakra and Malinga. What's Doni going to do? Shuffle across his stumps? No, that will be a wide. No, he can't. Oh, gets through Sangakara. Skids low. Kohli desperate to get back on strike. Kohli doesn't get back on strike. Bye is given. Well, I said it was a contest between one of the greatest death bowlers ever and one of the greatest finishers ever. And at the moment, Malinga's winning. No, he can't get the helicopter shot away. The pressure telling on India. He hasn't had much hit in the tournament. And it's showing under pressure. A big heave when he's informed that goes to the stands. I've never seen the Iceman flustered. Never seen Dhoni flustered until now. He's been waiting to bat and now he's gone out there and they bowled brilliantly at him. Still three deliveries for him to do some damage. Brilliant, Malinga. Brilliant. They'll come back for two. But this is outstanding death bowling. Oh, you just know what's coming, but you can't do anything about it. And about half an hour later, Kohli gets on strike. I mean, in the 16th over, he must have been in the 70s. And if someone had said to him, well, you'll be in there with one ball to go and you'll only be 76, he would have laughed at you. Outstanding, Lassif Malinga, they will try and come back for two. They do come back for two, direct it, they'll go upstairs. Wouldn't that be a fitting ending, that, if that is a run out to some brilliant cricket from Sri Lanka in the last five overs. I said in the last game, you can often judge how India have done by the body language of Virat Kohli. He's gone this time. Well, it's been his day. But... The big screen will show Virat Kohli out. 19 runs have come in the last four overs. MS Tony putting a pat on Virat Kohli's back.